All right, guys, I got company today. Not just me by myself. Hopefully, we'll have some better luck. So today, we are heading out to the back section where I actually saw some guys yesterday catching some fish. So we're actually not even bringing an auger. We're gonna punch some holes and, uh, or just break open some holes that they had from yesterday. It's still warm out here, so we got plenty of ice and uh, the hole shouldn't really be frozen over at all. So I think we're gonna be good to go. We've got uh, six tip-ups, a bunch of roaches, larges and mediums. Hopefully we don't toss everything behind us on our drive out. I don't know if it recorded that. Okay, I'm just getting one of my holes ready. All right guys, we've got four in so far. We are really spreading out. I've not ever spread out this far. Like I said earlier, we're not uh, we're not drilling any holes. We're just uh, reusing the holes that uh, the group that was out here yesterday. I, uh, I came out here on the four-wheeler and in the couple minutes that I was here, they actually caught a bass out of the hole Tammy just set up in and they caught a nice bass back where we put the jaw jacker. So, we're uh, really taking advantage of all this area that they covered yesterday. There was like four of them. So we figure there's a dozen holes out here. We've only found five of them so far, but uh, we'll find one more between here and the jaw jacker on that side and uh, we'll get set up. So we're in about five foot of water here. Uh, there are a lot of weeds down there. So I'm hoping that uh, we can take advantage of these weeds and we got some fish sitting in them. Um, we'll, uh, Hopefully with any luck, since we haven't caught a fish yet this year through the ice, hopefully with any luck we'll have a little better luck today. So all I'm using is I'm using a, on this one, I'm using a number four uh, Gamakatsu treble hook. And I've just got it a, a small little split weight on the bottom. We're just fishing a hair off the bottom today, down closest to those weeds as we can get them. And we're tipping these uh, Gamakatsu hooks, hooks with uh, medium or large roaches. So this one's a little bit of a smaller hook uh, compared to some of the other ones I've got. So I'm going to put a medium roach on this one. Uh, I do have some large roaches on the other ones. I'm not really sure what they're feeding on. I wasn't sure what they were using yesterday. I'm going to actually put a little bit smaller one on this. Hopefully uh, one of these will figure out what size they're, they're feeding on. So we'll uh, drop this down it all up. Nicely done, Jim. Boy, that was slick, huh? And off he goes. I know my line marker and this one's just above that. Just above that. Uh, snap swivel I've got on there so and this one is a one of my beaver dam tip ups this white thing that you see on here if you guys are ever in the market for inexpensive um, alarms or tip up signalers you see I've got a little piece of black velcro here I didn't bring the alarms with me today since it's just the two of us and we know that these are all of our tip ups but if you go to the hardware stores you can usually find for a dollar uh, window alarms so this is the little magnet. I have a little block and I put the window alarm on there. And when that flag goes up, it is an ear piercing, uh, ear piercing alarm sound. We could literally hear it halfway across the lake. So if one of these goes up, and I've been out at tournaments, uh, derbies where we've been fishing and um, it's still dark or there's just hundreds of tip ups in a, you know, in a couple hundred yard area and these things go off and there is no question whose tip up it is. So for a dollar a piece, those are a great inexpensive tip up. Uh, they do work at night, obviously, cause it's just sound. So you don't have the light feature on it, but you do have the, uh, you do have the sound. So you can obviously uh, figure out where it's coming from. So we're gonna head off. Tammy's got the last one. I got the jaw jacker, the hot wheel camo one. Tammy's setting up the last one. So let's go follow her and uh, get that last tip up set. Got 
There it goes. There it goes. Let it go. All right. Fish this winter through the ice. First fish of the year. 